Hey, welcome to the channel. This is your host Chidmoy Bhattacharya and today we are going to talk about Citrix upgrade process. When you need Citrix upgrade, I think you need to consider the Citrix update once there is a new release of Citrix version or else if you are going to be out of support of Citrix. Now you need to have Citrix support in case there is a major issue in your environment and you are not sure what the issue is in that case you will need uh, or may need citrix support so i'll advise to have the citrix support there now the, the steps um, that are required uh, to upgrade an a citrix environment that depend uh, on what are the components you have um, I will make a video later on demonstrating uh, the upgrade process but for now I will only concentrate on the process or the steps that needs to be followed. So you need to have the backup that is a must in case there is an issue so that you can revert back to your earlier state. So ensure that you have uh, the backup of your database you have the snapshot of all your critical components like delivery controller, director, storefront, license server, these kind of components. Now once you have the backup, I will suggest that you do a preliminary health check of your server site and then if all goes fine and you think that you are ready to upgrade, start the upgrade. So to start with, uh, I'll suggest that you upgrade your license server. If, um, that is also needs to be upgraded in your environment. Uh, but before that also please make sure you have the necessary backup of the license files just in case it is required later on. So upgrade your license server, it's, it should be a normal or very easy process, run the installer, upgrade your license server. Once your license server has been upgraded, I would recommend you to upgrade your uh, storefront and probably upgrade your director, Citrix director, uh, if it's uh, installed on a separate machine. Then once that is done, you uh, will need to consider whether you are going to upgrade your VDAs or not. Uh, I would recommend to, uh, that you upgrade uh, the VDAs at the same time so that you, you keep uh, the versions uh, um, as far with the your Zen desktop version but in case there is some issue or you want to upgrade your VDA version later on uh, that is also possible it's not a mandatory thing but please consider uh, it is always recommended uh, to upgrade the VDA version as well and then uh, you should uh, upgrade your uh, um, data controller uh, in this stage, uh, I would recommend you do one or two uh, if you have um, many of um, multiple data controller in your environment. I would recommend that you take half of them and you upgrade them. And once those are upgraded, uh, you need to go to the studio and there you will uh, open the studio console and then uh, um, you will have the option to upgrade the database there. Uh, there are two options that you can choose either you can automatically upgrade your database or update your database uh, directly from the studio uh, or else you can um, export the configuration file or export the file uh, from your uh, controller studio and you give it to a DBA uh, and then the DBA person runs it uh, on the database so both ways are possible and valid one now the databases are upgraded you do the site checks again and see if everything is right then upgrade your uh, other data, uh, data controllers as well uh, and uh, do another round of check uh, you must check uh, the applic few applications also if they are running fine after this upgrade and then it should be fine However, if you feel that there is a necessity to, to roll back to an earlier version uh, in case it is not running or um, something is broken after the upgrade, uh, in that case uh, I'd recommend that you uh, uh, revert back your database first and then once the databases are reverted you revert back your uh, all the machines uh, to the earlier snapshots and um, then you should be fine. 
but in case you have critical any any kind of critical issue i'll always recommend that uh, you ask for help from, from citric support uh, without uh, trying to do uh, all those critical investigation yourself uh, if that is uh, something beyond your reach okay uh, i think that should be fine I, i'll try to uh, make a video with this step by step guide but um, just in case you have any comment or recommendation please uh, uh, do not uh, hesitate to put in the comment box thank you